what are your thoughts about what happens pre-birth and post-death? Oh, that's fun. Pre-birth, I haven't spent a lot of time on pre-birth, but I know post-death, we're still connected. So that is a really, I just know we are. Because I, um, and I didn't, I wasn't 100% sure until my mom died. And she, she left us with this giant rainbow, spectacular rainbow that came from nowhere. And, and all of a sudden there was this spectacular rainbow. And I thought, because we were all sort of flipping out, we had just lost our mother. And uh, just by going outside, all of a sudden we saw this spectacular rainbow. And we've seen, there have been other sort of interesting signs. I won't go into all of them. There is more. And I think that, af that at first they, they want to make sure, like when people die, they want to make sure that everything uh, goes according to their plan. And after that, I think they have another adventure. And so that mm -hmm. over time they, they move on to their other adventures. Yeah. So I think there is more. Um, and I don't know whether the two things are linked, whether you, you know, if you do well here, you do well there. Um, but I do know that we're connected. I also believe that we're interconnected with yes. each other yes. throughout the world. How many times have you thought of somebody and then seen them at the grocery store about an hour later? Uh, that kind of thing. We are all interconnected. So there are all of these. There may be neurons firing in here, and there may be, um, by the way, your gut actually, actually so, does have a brain to it. <laughs> and uh, so your brain and your gut uh, not only are in this body, but they are also connected with all these other bodies. We are interconnected. We're, we're actually connected with the plants and animals, too. And I think those connections are not uh, as easy, not as strong, but they are there. And, uh, and then the before birth. Could be that adventure you were talking about, the next adventure. They could be in a previous adventure. Uh-huh. Previous adventure to this next I mean, what's interesting is, I don't know if other people have felt this, but I have felt that I would get um, some new piece of, of educational material and I'll look at it and I'll go, I already know this. And I know it's new to my life, but I already know it. Mm. I'm not sure why that is or how that happened, but I already know it. So I think that there are things that, um, th that connect from previous life to now and from now to future life. And so I'm, you know, after my mom died, all of a sudden I realized, hey, it's mm. okay. It, it's okay. We're, this is just a part of a longer, much more extraordinary adventure. And story of yeah. civilization. And then there's something I always like to sort of throw out to my students and mm -hmm. other people. Look up at the stars and realize that you're just on this little marble flying through space. Um, pearl, I guess. Mm -hmm. um, look up at the stars and then, and then think how amazing, how many stars there are and all that. Think of is there an end to that? And then you think, wait, if there's an end, what are you boxed in? How does that work? Or is there no end to that? And both are equally <laughs> freaky to think about. <laughs>